just doing a Chevy rubber style uh, rear main seal conversion on a throw weight engine here. Uh, basically set it up in the boring bar and bore the rear lip out in the main cap area in that position there so that the rear lip seal sits over top of that dimension. So what happens is a factory throw weight runs a rope style seal, this sort of thing. So uh, just basically sits on the rear uh, seal area and wipes it all off and it's an ugly thing so we get rid of that and we run the Chevy style lip seal which is this type rubber seal far less drag on the crank better seal um, so what's going to happen is the crankshaft area in this area here where the seal runs on is got to get machined down to 2.431 it's about a hundred thousand smaller than the rope seal dimension on the factory crankshaft so 2.431 that gets machined down to and the block area gets machined to 2.778 so what I do is a setup So taken a very small cut. I've taken a couple of one mil cuts here already, so this is only the last 10 thou, 12 thou cut to finish the diameter with a creek diameter. That's it, that's the, the basic simple way of doing a Chevy lip style seal conversion onto a throw weight engine.